Bringing robotic process automation into your organization will make a significant impact on your business's digital transformation when done properly. The Center of Excellence is responsible for four key services. Governance, which covers providing governance documents like RPA request forms, PDD forms, and methods for liaising between the development teams and the SMEs for effective collaboration. They are also responsible for tools and technology, process documents and best practices, and training people in the RPA team and staff team members. There are many roles required for your Centre of Excellence team. The Programme Manager is brought into the team to report to the RPA sponsor. The Programme Manager is responsible for delivering this capability. The Programme Manager, the Business Analyst, form a partnership to liaise between the business and the development team and various levels. Many of these team roles can be performed by the same person, for example, the business analyst. This is the most important and essential role, with responsibility for liaising with staff teams via the subject matter experts, the developers and the solutions architect. In some setups, developer teams are offshore or near shore. In small teams, lead RPA business analysts in many cases can take on responsibilities of the project manager to ensure projects are completed on time and on budget. Sometimes they can take on the role of the change manager or evangelist as well. To promote the benefits to stakeholders, communicate progress and success, and run lunch and learn workshops. The RPA Business Analyst's core role is to work closely with subject matter experts to capture their requirements and translate the business problem into a technical solution using the process definition document, which they then give to the developer. The process definition document is considered the most important document in the whole RPA implementation process. We've included a template in the AEIOU toolkit.